The Story of a Prostitute is a uh, war drama film by director Seijin Suzuki. That's the only reason why I checked it out. Now, I've seen quite a few of this director's films, most of them being gangster ones that are very flashy and full of like action and interesting characters, over-the-top visual style. I really like him. But this one's a really different, though. It, uh, it has some of the visual flair, but it's more of a war film, which I wasn't expecting. This one is about Harumi. She is a woman who faces some heartbreak when one of her clients marries someone that's not her. So she volunteers to be a comfort woman on the Japanese front uh, when they're fighting Manchuria. So she basically just wants to, you know, work and make money at this brothel. However, uh, they, there's only a good 13 prostitutes there to service a thousand uh, men, soldiers, plus civilians, plus non-combatants, so there's just too much demand. But she wants to, like, sort of lose herself. And, of course, there's this brutal adjutant who is sort of in charge of the entire battalion who uh, likes to cut the line and, you know, treat her badly. And he's sort of in charge, so she can't, really can't do anything about it. However, she falls for the man's aid. Um, and, uh, you know, they try to have an affair, and she tries to, like... Use her feminine wiles to sort of trick, not trick, but sort of influence her, her lover or the young man into killing his superior. But they keep getting interrupted by war. You know, lots of stuff happens in this movie. There's a lot of uh, brutal fighting and combat, um, half drama, half war film. And um, the movie does really have a bleak tone. It's a really interesting sort of emotional turmoil of what it means to be, be a chaste woman, how society looks down on you if you choose a certain profession, but also personal honor, because uh, back in World War II, they would really be into the whole never being taken prisoner, and if you do, you face shame, you should have died in battle. So they have the whole, that aspect, and then, yeah, the movie's just pretty bleak. It's definitely a different, completely different tone from his gangster films, which are more like action-packed, sort of flashy characters. This one's more of a down-to-earth, bleak drama with war elements so it's still an interesting film though because of its ending so i give the story of a prostitute a six out of ten